Your landlord probably has insurance to cover the house or apartment building that you live in. But if your bicycle or television is stolen, that's your problem. My insurance covers my property only. It does not cover the tenants or uh, any of their property, nor does it cover them in case there's a lawsuit against them. Be careful with that, because that one's expensive. Renter's insurance will replace your property if it's stolen or damaged in a fire. It covers furniture, clothing, and most other personal belongings, whether they are in your home or elsewhere. Yeah, you can just set it against the far wall. Before you buy, estimate the value of your property, then do an inventory. Take pictures. It will provide a permanent record in case you file a claim with your insurance company. If you own jewelry or expensive furs, you will need a special floater to cover them. Many people don't understand that there are limits in their insurance policy for some of their valuable possessions, like a fur coat or a valuable ring or even a new computer system. You need to get special insurance for those specific items to be covered. The cost of renter's insurance varies depending on your deductible and the amount of coverage you need. And be sure your new home has a smoke detector and a good deadbolt lock. You might then also qualify for a discount on your policy. Carolyn Gorman reporting.